started today. Uh, I also played this game called Lego Worlds. Now, uh, some of you guys may not have seen it at all. I got some video for you guys uh, to look at. This is a gameplay that I took earlier today. Um, I actually posted a GIF on uh, Twitter from GIFCat playing the game. Uh, I had downloaded it immediately after I heard about it at work. Um, I, I like the Lego games. Kyle, I don't know if you've played that many of the Lego games, but I like like the basic mechanics of the Lego games. I think I played uh, Star Wars. Yeah, I mean, I, I think we played Star Wars at eBash at yeah. least when I was when I was going through that uh, uh, gamer challenge or whatever the Xbox Score challenge. Yeah. Um, so I, I killed a wizard right there. You can actually. Uh, each person that you find or thing that you find is, uh, yeah, is you just like uh, push your button to his face. <laughs> yeah, basically. Uh, but each thing that you find is is collectible. So, like, if you encounter an enemy, like I did just there, that that skull guy, um, then after you kill them, you can collect them, and then you can play as them. Uh, but you have to unlock them with. Uh, after you unlock them, you have to purchase them with in-game currency. Uh, which you find throughout the world you know how you would destroy stuff in star wars and then like those lego coins would pop out sure. uh so it's basically that same type of ordeal um you know you find something in the world i think we're coming up on something that uh, is interactable uh you can collect it and then once you destroy it some coins will pop out like that and then that goes to your towards your total pool um there are uh, i mean the basis of the game is like it's a sandbox building and exploration game uh so it's very minecraft minecraft esque i'm actually surprised that we haven't seen this game sooner um i thought there was a lego mo at one point but i can't remember definitively there could have been but this is still like this is this is like create this is minecraft basically this yeah. is like I don't know. In my opinion, this could potentially be a better Minecraft. It depends on how much they do with mod support and things of that nature. Um, considering that Lego is uh, traditionally, from what I've heard, pretty ridiculous when it comes to like their IP um, and having blocks that are only from the block set in there. So mods trying to get in and make a whole bunch of stuff might not fly with them. Um, so I'd be interested to see what they could do with the IP. Uh, just to give you an idea, like I found this horse, I can get on the horse, I'm riding around on the horse. Uh, there's other vehicles, other animals, uh, and another gameplay session, I, I, I rode around on a bear. And the gif that I uh, posted, I was on an ostrich. Um, I saw I saw this dude fly a dragon. Uh, he flew a dragon? Dude, yeah, he flew a dragon. I saw a dude fly an eagle. Uh, Tell I, me more about this dragon. Dude. It was a it was a red and black dragon, and then he was flying like he took off with it, and then he like he got so excited he hit E, which is to to ride and and you know get off of the the animals. Yeah. And he dropped the dragon in lava and killed it, and he was really <laughs> upset. So I saw a dragon. I didn't get to see a whole lot of gameplay, but I imagine it can breathe fire. I would assume, right? So I would hope so. Can you I burn thinking, other players? Well, I'm gonna switch to my wizard. Take a look at this. I'm gonna switch to my oh, wizard, wizard, and the wizard does fireballs. So I know that dragon has to be able to shoot fireballs if the wizard can. It's so, clearly a warlock, by the way. Oh, wizard, warlock, whatever, Colin. Don't even. Don't even. Look at that. Blew up that tree. Say the same thing. Uh, but look, I, I honestly for fourteen ninety nine for an early access game, I'm gonna tell you guys, I might sink a little bit of time into this more so than I would like a Minecraft game, I think, because I, I genuinely like the Lego universe. Um, so, you know, I'm, I'm really interested to see where they take this. Are they going to add the DC characters? Are they going to add the Marvel characters? Are they going to add, you know, all that's the Star Wars lightsaber? Are they going to be able to do that stuff that kind of was like, it's like the facto, you know, Lego. So they have a lot of set pieces you can um, put in the game. There was a, there was a, I put like a volcano down, um, so they, I know I don't know all the stock things that you can place, but like you know you can collect trees, bushes, stuff like that that you find, and you can put those in there. Look at the fireball, <laughs> spam! Just trying to blow a hole into the world. Now what I did find is like if you dis uh, like blow up the the Legos, you can like find stuff. So like there was randomly a uh, 
a bulldozer in like one of the <laughs> one of the uh mountains that i blew up yeah why not all right so yeah i mean that's how kind of how you collect stuff so it kind of encourages you to blow things up and explore and you know find different stuff that you can unlock now this portion is the building and uh it's pretty simplistic um you know i, I personally like it uh this is this is actually terraforming not building you can actually build individual set pieces but we're in the terraforming where you can like uh, basically construct the world uh, and make it how you kind of see fit. In addition to having the single blocks that are all in the Lego pieces where you can like build specific buildings that you want to build the Eiffel Tower, you can build it from individual Lego pieces. And right now I'm just raising and flattening the land. You guys can kind of see it's really fast, which is I prefer faster uh, style building. Now, when you get into the individual blocks, it's a little bit more tedious. Controls don't seem like they're quite intuitive, but it's it's early access. It's on Steam, fourteen ninety nine. I uh, didn't see any PvP uh, currently. Seems like it's just single player, so they're obviously uh, missing that. I'm out. I, I'm out. I would hope I would hope that there is some player versus player that they have in the future, but uh, that's all we got for for you guys right there. So it's need it's some, pretty good. Need some Lego Dragon duels with the kids. It's pretty good. I, I look. I thought it was fun, man. Uh, it looks pretty cool. Yeah. They're, they're, uh, the other thing with this is there was no absolutely no prior marketing they just literally were like hey we got this game it's done you can purchase it well it's in early access you can purchase it right now and that was it so it's pretty cool pretty cool if you like this video you should probably click on the one down below that'll take you to another video you may like it a little bit about me i'm a former pro player i play pc and console mostly shooters i also have a gaming podcast i do tips and tactics live gameplays check out my twitch also, I work in the industry. Why are you not subscribed?